Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a SAS walkthrough. I know it's pretty much coming to a close, but I did want to head over to my outlet store in Katie Mills Mall. Um, in Katy, Texas and see what they have. I'm sure they still have a lot of stuff for 75% off. I'm really looking for some beach nights. I want to get a full set that I can save for next summer in case it doesn't come out again. And then just really look at stuff, 75% off candles and things like that I'm still interested in, but I don't need to get a lot. But yeah, I really want to just see what they have and see if they have any fall and Halloween too. They probably don't because it's an outlet. They're still going to be getting in stuff well into August for um, SAS. That's what happened last year at least. I don't know about this year, but um, I expect that to happen. And then I do actually have some footage that I filmed the other day on um, Tuesday of another store. Just a re regular Bath & Body Works store. I don't even think it's a white barn. I think it's just a Bath & Body Works Um and I'll insert that footage here because there was some good finds. Um, I'll insert that after the um, outlet mall so you guys can see that one too, how a regular store will look near the end of SAS. But yeah, it's coming to a close. Halloween stuff is coming out either July 15th or 18th. So it's about to be finished with. But let's go ahead. I'm going to drive down to Katie and pick up my mom and me and her are going to go shopping. So let's get into it. All right, so we are pulling up on Bath & Body Works. I literally love the outlet store. They always have the best stuff. So starting off, we have the $3 table, which is still a bunch of Christmas stuff. Nothing new there. Um, they did have a few moisturizing body washes, which was good to find, and then even some fall stuff still. So get that for a good deal now because <laughs> they're coming back out with it already. But um, I did find a few online exclusives. And then 50% off candles, Nothing to write home about on this one. $3 wallflowers, which I think is still a good deal. Um, and they had some really nice scents. So there was strawberry daiquiri, dark amber, and oud, which I sniffed that one. It was like very masculine, a little too much for me. Warm ocean breeze, sunshine mimosa, sun wash citrus. So all pretty much the spring and summer scents. And then 50% off still on this Fun Fair collection, which I think maybe it's going to 75% off soon. I can't remember. Um, but Strawberry Soda is still 50% off. That should go down soon. So should that whole Fruit Fizz collection. And then Cucumber Melon is still going for 50% off. So is Cherry Blossom. And then this Fresh Coconut Colada, this whole little collection. I have not seen Coconut Pineapple in stores. That was the first time I had seen it in stores, but... And then more 50% off candles. I think these were candle day exclusives that were online only. Um, and then 50% off. They actually had some Easter ones, which I'm pretty sure is 75% off if I price checked it. And the whole wall right here said 50% off, but I actually think it might have been 75. And if it is, I need to go back. I don't need to go back. Obviously, I don't need to buy anything else, but I would like to get that Valentine's Day collection for 75% off. That would be great. More 75% off. I couldn't get the front table when I first walked in, so I'm getting it now. But basically, a lot of body creams, um, this whole little late summer collection, um, they have that at every single store. They must have just like made way too much of that. The 4th of July collection, Firecracker Pop, what, Pink Watermelon Blast. They did not have any of the vanilla confetti or the confetti sparkler or whatever. Basically, confetti cake pop. But... They did have a ton of men's stuff, which I was surprised about. And I guess it's the new body cream formula for men as well. And then my store had so much into the night. They even had the glowing body scrub, which I hadn't seen anywhere else yet. They had Pure Wonder. They had A Thousand Wishes. So many of those fragrances. They also had Sea Island Shore, Whitewater Rush, and Magnolia Charm, which was good to see. Some Moonlight Path over there. Back to the 75% off um, Body Care, the whole little brunch collection. They only had a few scents from that, but Buttercups and Berry Bellina, they had so much of that one. They must have thought it would be very popular, and it was, but they just had a lot of extra stock. And then, of course, more body creams because they're reformulating. Gingham and Butterfly, Pure Wonder. There's even like a little, I think it's a shampoo. And Love and Sunshine, 
little puffer fish. I thought this was a really good deal for 75% off. If you have kids, you could pick that up early for Easter next year. And the home body collection, they didn't have a lot of left. And then I did find some salt water breeze, which is online exclusive. And that was the only poolside coconut colada I saw that whole, this whole year for SAS. $3 hand soaps. They had the fun like rainbow cereal, uh, the kettle corn hand soap collection. That was really cool. Carnival kettle corn. Um, for $3. I think it's a really good deal. They never do that sale like besides SAS. So pretty good deal to stock up on some soaps. I love pistachio cream puff, so I had to show you guys that one. And they still have these for $3, so still a really good deal on that uh, chocolate mint swirl. They had some aromatherapy, some snowflakes and cashmere right there. And then here's the back of that confetti daydream. We had some oh, snowflakes and cashmere again, open sky, some starlit night, sea salt and lavender, which is online exclusive, some bar soaps some french lavender and honey and brown sugar and fig and honey wildflower tons of little 75 percent off single wicks which i am not in the market for single wicks right now um but really good deal on those especially if you like those i consider getting sweet cinnamon pumpkin but i i refrained and then we had a two dollar section of a bunch of bunch of minis they had so many minis at this store it was like unbelievable. They also had some uh, car fragrance refills, so much Christmas leftovers. Um, they had this whole thing was full of pumpkin clove little minis for $2, or not minis, fragrance refills for $2. And then you can see there is some more Christmas. And then more $2 stuff. We had some hand soaps, Honolulu Sun. We had some leftover um, Christmas ones, ice cinnamon roll, island papaya, twisted peppermint, frosted coconut snowball, and this one at the bottom, White Waves. And then this was right at the checkout. They had $4.95 like duo wallflower refills. I thought this was a great deal. Basically $2.50 each. And they had so many autumn scents. I was really excited to find that. Okay, we're transporting back in time. This is from last Tuesday. I figured I'd show you guys because they did actually have some good stuff in my store. So 50% off again on the Fruit Fizz collection. They had so much of this collection. And I know a lot of people were looking for watermelon lemonade and they couldn't find it. So my store must have gotten all of it. But 75% off. We have some strawberry pound cake hand soaps. Some single wicks. This was a random find. Somebody must have returned it. Salted butterscotch and vanilla and strawberry pound cake. More uh, body creams over here. And then going over to the front, some Sunshine Mimosa, some Hello Beautiful, um, more of the Homebody collection, and some One in a Million and a random hand soap, not hand soap, bar soap. Um, more 75% off. They had so much Sunset Glow. I was, I was really surprised they had the sprays in that one. Um, Country Apple and Pink Chiffon. I was looking for the shower gel in that one. I couldn't find it. More Buttercups and Berry Bellini. You can see some more um, hand soaps and stuff over here. This is 75% off. A thousand Christmas wishes, just like super random. Just one right there. Um, some more of that collection. Frosted Coconut Snowballs back there. Some more brunch collection stuff. They had so many sprays on this one um, setup. Like it was kind of insane. <laughs> Peace Iced uh, Raspberry Bellini, which I haven't seen that one at many stores lately. Pear Creme Boulet. Going on the back side, we had some hand soaps in pink lilac and vanilla. Um, some more Christmas scents. And oh, yeah, I did find vanilla mocha cream in the spray. That was a really good find. For 75% off, it would have been at $3.88. So really good find at that, at that store. I was not expecting to find that. And then I think these were all 75% off as well. So some little mini gingham... Uh, shampoos some mini sprays mini lotion and bubbly rosé they had so many of those some sp hand sprays antibacterial sprays some lip glosses some more bubbly rosé in the hand lotion and also this what's a raspberry tangerine hand cream and then on the front they had those like little mermaid lanyards and some pocket backs so really good finds there and then more $3 hand soaps, which it's just basically the summer collections. Um, nothing crazy here, but still good because we still have like two or three more months of le left of summer to use all these hand soaps. And they did have fall candles out. They we had not put them out yet, but they were stacked up. And this was the only fall that I found at those two stores. 
So that was a little sad, but here's this three wick in Hinoki wood and lavender. And I'm showing you the notes there. You can pause to read that. But um, this is what I was really looking forward to. Spiced pumpkin and patchouli. And oh my God, I'm going to have to pick up like multiple of those. It's so beautiful. It's like a sophisticated pumpkin scent. Coffee and whiskey was not for me. Honestly, it was very like dusty men's cologne. I don't know. I didn't like it. Um, Cypress and amber, which I knew I wouldn't like, so I didn't smell that. I don't like tree scents. Um, and leather and brandy, which was really good. Kind of a take on mahogany teak wood, but a little slightly different. It had like fresh air to it. So that one was really good. All right, y'all. It is hot outside, but we are finished shopping. I'm actually in the car about to leave my mom's house, but we did some good shopping. And um, honestly, the outlet was not the best because I know... Some of the candles were marked 50% off, but they're actually 75, but they weren't ringing up that way. So that was disappointing. And like Beach Nights was only 50% off, but online it was 75% off. So that was a little weird, but they still had some great stuff out still. They had a lot of $3 body care. They still had the, um, the mint, the mint swirl, chocolate mint swirl. They still had that. They still had a lot of $3, $2 body care. So really good for body care. Not great for candles. They don't have any, um, I'm sorry, I gotta take a sip. It's so hot. They didn't have any 75% um, off candles, but honestly still a really good deal. So I do have a haul and I have my bags back here actually. So I'll do a haul for you guys later and that'll be in a separate video. But thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed. If you did, like, comment, and subscribe down below and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.